This is classic Sundanese food. And we're going to start with the welcoming drink. This right here is the bajigur. It is made out of coconut milk, extremely rich. It almost looks like milk tea. And I know there's a little bit of something at the bottom of this. Do you see this? I'm not entirely sure what it is, but it looks good. So here we go. Bajigor down the hatch. That warms the soul. Ah, you can really taste that coconut. And it, it is as rich as it looks, and even sweeter. It's a perfect way to build up some appetite. Ah, that's wonderful. That's only part one of the welcoming drinks. Here's part two. This is called Bandre. And it is a uh, ginger drink. So I've been told it's very, very spicy. And it's perfect really for this weather because it's quite cooling here. So something to just heat the body up just a little bit. Oh, just the minute that hits the, your throat, you can feel that ginger spice. There's a lot of grated ginger in there, so you know this, this one is pretty strong stuff. But this is perfect. Absolutely perfect. I think it's only fair that I take off my cap because it deserves at least that amount of respect. Bring on the nasi baka and sambal dorong. Even the presentation of this dish just is perfection. I feel like you could frame this and put it in an art gallery and it will sell for millions. That looks beautiful. So you got your nasi baka, which is wrapped up in banana leaf. And it has some salted fish in there to give that a little bit of saltiness to the rice, to flavor the rice. You got your sambal turong that looks so ra radioactive that it might just burn a hole in my stomach. Um, you got little baby eggplants, you've got tauhu, you've got your tempeh, and a piece of fried chicken. Yeah. You know your boy likes fried chicken. All right, okay. I feel like I need a PhD in Sundanese cuisine to figure this one out. It's like a Sudoku puzzle, I don't even know where to start. Ah. All right, whatever, let's just break this one open. Oh, it's like, a, it's like one of those games you play when you're a kid at like birthday parties where you wrap up like newspaper and after each wrap there's like a gift and you pass the parcel. Yeah, pass the parcel, that's the name of the game. All right, we're getting there, we're getting there. When I asked the, the manager, lovely guy, what's inside this? He said, oh, it's rice and salted fish. So I thought it was just rice and salted fish. Am I, I mean, who am I to doubt the manager of Kampung Dao, right? I mean, he's a good guy, why would he lie to me? Well, guess what he did? Because there's so much more in this nasi baka than just salted fish. You got sweet, sweet basil leaves in here. You got little bits of chili. I can see some anchovies in there. All right, all right, enough, enough chit chat. That looks beautiful. Let's just cut this one open. Oh, that looks good. Nasi baka, what are you about? When you steam rice, it tends to be a bit starchy. It can be very heavy. But for some reason or another, when you grill it, grill rice, it's light, it's fluffy. There's the right amount of salted fish in there to just season every grain of rice perfectly. The sweet basil leaf just gives that extra intensity, the spice as well. Whoa, man, oh mama. This is so, so good. I never thought I could be excited about what looks like a very simple rice dish. This gets me very excited. This is the first time I've ignored a piece of fried chicken for rice. I almost forgot about it, but thank God I didn't. Fried. <sighs> that is the mark of a tender piece of chicken when the bone just falls right off. It is magical. It is out of this world. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ho, ho. I do have a very dangerous love affair with deep fried chicken skin. I know, it's not the healthiest, but... My God, that tastes so good. I, I am at a loss for words. I never thought food as simple as this could taste so amazing on so many levels. Presentation, the flavors, it has just been an absolute joy. Kampung Daun lives up to all expectations, you know, and I don't think you need me to say it. You know what this means. Kampung Daun. <laughs>